Hey guys, Luca here with another PvP build, this time with my Magicka Nightblade. I already made a Magicka Nightblade build, but it was a specific bomb build. Now I tried to do a good 1vx small skill build. So let's take a good look. On the front bar, War Maiden. It gives us almost 600 spell damage for our magic damage abilities. So let's take a quick look on our skills, on our damage ability skills. Swallow, magic damage. Soul harvest, magic damage. Assassin's will, magic damage. Shadow image, magic damage. And impale, also magic damage. So war maiden and pause all of our magic damage abilities which are basically every single skill on the Nightblade. As defensive set, Pariah. In heavy armor, we need a defensive set on a Magicka Nightblade. The damage incoming is in this patch insane with Mastered Arms, Backstabber, Fighting Finesse. In every corner, a Gang Blade or a Bomb Blade waits that can literally one-shot you. I've tried a couple of light armor sets like Nico Potency, Ancient Dragon Guard, Burning Spare Wolf, that kind of stuff, but no chance, I was just too squishy for that. Even with Dedrick Trickery, that's why I've decided to use Pariah instead, which gives us a ton of resistances. As monster set, Balrog for extra weapon damage and penetration. Bloodspawn is also possible here. On the back bar, a critical repose restoration stuff for more crit resistance. Traits and glyphs, full arcane on jewelry with two spell damage glyphs and one magic Dutch glyph. On body, full prismatic, five impen and two well fitted. Then our war maiden inferno stuff in sharpened for extra penetration with a flame damage enchant. And on the back bar, a defending restoration stuff with the berserker will affect the weapon damage. Skills on the front bar are elemental drain for major breach and minor magicka steel. So another 6k more penetration and a little bit of sustain. Impale or execute, swallow soul or spammable. Alternative you could go for elemental weapon instead. Merciless charge for the 10% extra crit damage and for Assassin's Will, a powerful bow proc, Mass Hysteria, our AoE fear. Alternative, if you don't want to play with your CC, go with Inner Light here instead. Ultimate Soul Harvest, super powerful, it still gives major defile, so 16% less healing uh, for the target. I've also tried Soul Teller instead, since Soul Harvest is easy dodgeable. On the back bar, Dark Cloak, a pretty nice hot and it gives minor protection too. Another 5% damage reduction. Rapid regen, a strong hot. Race against time, our snare removal. Gives major expedition, 30% more movement speed. And minor force, 10% more crit damage. Then siphoning attacks for sustain. And heats a little bit too. Shadow image, the strongest skill in terms of mobility. And as defensive ultimate, the restoration ultimate. Light Champion, one of the strongest defensive ultimates out there, pretty strong, it gives major force, so 20% more crit damage. As race, I'm Khajiit for 12% extra crit damage, High Elf for Dunmore are fine too. As Buffwood, the Clockwork Cetus Fillet for extra Magicka region, as Mundus, the Artronac Mundus. Potions, I use this ones with Spell damage, spare crit and magicka. Sometimes even detection potions to fuck up the other night blades. <laughs> and uh, tricep potions too with magicka, health and stamina. Quick look on the CPs. Master at arms, deadly aim, resilience and dual rebuff. Red CPs, rejuvenation, slippery, bastion and boundless vitality. Now some gameplay for you, if you like my content don't forget to sub my channel, almost 90% are still not subbed to my channel. Do me the favor, click on this red juicy button and make me a bit more happy.
enjoy the gameplay footage. We are done with another PvP build video, I hope you enjoyed it, thanks for watching, stay tuned for more PvP content, the Midian Mayhem event is still up, I wish you all a fantastic day, enjoy the wonderful weather outside, stay healthy and I see you in the next video, ciao.